Hey, welcome back. Today is going to be like a love letter to my favourite Animal Crossing village, Mabel. Or kind of like a, a, a love build, I suppose. But I mean, she's, she's like my little kindred bear because she never forgets to have fun no matter how old you are. And that is like basically my motto. And I love hanging out with her in her cute little house, even when it's like almost midnight. And she's got, she, she totes, wants to just go to bed, but she's too polite to kick me out. Or, you know, I just like to stop stalk her when she's out wandering around but just slowly slowly stalk her and she's going I love you Ellie but what what the what what are you doing oh and then Vladimir joins us too my creepy pink bear I love the bears I just love them I think she's starting to get a bit creeped out now yep she's going yeah please just go away please just make it stop but I can't I can't make it stop because I love her so much and we're going to do her Lego Animal Crossing build which is just a poly bag it's Maple's pumpkin garden it's just so wee but it's got Maple as a Lego minifigure in it <laughs> I'm here for it and I will just continue to be her bestie and she has to love me now all right so let's build this shall we let's find our little Maple pieces so she can always be with me. So she's got her little brown legs. She's got her her jumper, which is the same jumper she wears in the Animal Crossing New Horizons, which is so cute. And her little bear face. Look at her. I mean, just look at her. Now she has to love me because I can keep her with me always. How come she doesn't have bendy legs? The other Animal Crossing villagers have bendy legs. I feel like she got a bit ripped off there. So Rosie, who came in, you know, in the set that Rosie came in, I can't remember Oh, Nook's Cranny. Nook's Cranny in Rosie's house. She's got bendy legs. I'm pretty sure all the other ones have. Oh, oh little Mabel. Oh, she's not going to be able to sit down or anything, but that's okay because her entire function for this set is to tend her pumpkin garden. So she's got the watering can and it's just causing her to tip forwards a little bit. That's right. We'll pop her over here while we get our wee, 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 tiny, tiny, tiny little bill together, but it's going to be so cute. So we've got our dark green bit here. That's our connector piece. Got our bit of green land. I feel sad that we don't get her house because it's very, very quaint. Though we do have a lot of just the really nice villages currently in the Lego Animal Crossing choices. So they do tend to have nice rather than the crazy houses, but there are some really crazy houses. I love actually Vladimir's house, my pink, pink angry bear. His house is really, really wrong. It's a total hot mess. It's like it's a, it's like a garbage tip. I think it literally is supposed to be like a vacant lot where people have dumped all their stuff. Anyway, weird choice for a house, but we all live our lives the way we choose to. Okay, so we've got our, we've got a pumpkin. We've got a full pumpkin. We've got a little one growing for maple to actually to actually water and do you know what I actually did in my game I have moved her house next to where I had the pumpkin farm set up so now she actually is living her lego life in my actual animal crossing island <laughs> so just, it replicates real life and we've got a just a tiny little bit of a second level as well for a pine tree which I think is a really cute inclusion to give this some a bit of height but also I like the fact that there's a pine tree included because she also has a pine tree on her jumper so or on her sweater so I think that I, I don't know the reasons why the designers decided to do what they did, but I like the fact that they've popped it in. I think that's a really good plan. <laughs> I think everything's a good plan. So here's our pine tree. If we shake it, a, well, generally a brown stick will fall out of it, but we do have a spare green one, so that's cool. And that's it. That's our really, really soups cute little maple build. We can pop these together. And then, of course, you can use these as add-ons to the rest of the Animal Crossing builds, which are just absolutely so adorable. I still haven't finished building the first wave of these. Look at this. She can go up here. It just, just barely, barely fits up there. I wish I could pop her in an angle for while she's watering the garden, but I don't think I can. I'll have to play around with it. But anyway, we have now got another addition to our Lego Animal Crossing menagerie, because they're animals. Did I hear a rumor of like a minifigure series with the Animal Crossing characters? I haven't seen anything about it recently. I thought there was a, I thought it was coming, but maybe I'm wrong. I'm wrong about lots of stuff. If you know, let me know in the comments. But anyway, I'm gonna go back and just, you know, annoy. <laughs> <laughs> annoy Mabel for a little while till she goes to bed. Uh, bye! <laughs> so sorry, Mabel. I loves you. You're my favourite. <laughs> okay, see you soon. Bye!